Hey guys, Hackersploit here, back again with another video and finally the course is out, uh, I have finally completed making the course, uh, that's why I haven't uploaded in uh, almost a month now, I was working on this course, so this is the ethical hacking course, uh, this course is going to take you from a beginner to advanced in, in terms of ethical hacking, or if you're just learning uh, penetration testing. So uh, here we are. Um, so welcome everyone to the course. This is the first lesson uh, in the course. There will be a video every day. So uh, hopefully in a month you can actually reach an advanced level. So my name is Alexis and yeah, let's get to this. Um, so moving on to the next slide. Um, uh, what is hacking? So basically, we have, before we even start, we need to understand what hacking is. Now, hacking is the attempt to gain or gaining unauthorized access to data in a system. Now, if you're a white hat hacker, which uh, I'll talk, um, uh, I'll talk about in a few minutes, uh, a white hat uh, hacker is basically authorized to hack the system, but a black hat is unauthorized. So uh, you can look at it in both ways. So that's basically what hacking is. Now, uh, types of hackers. Uh, you all know the black hats. Uh, black hats are individuals with extraordinary computing skills uh, that use their skills for malicious or destructive uh, activities. So they're really using their skills for wrong and offensive purposes. We then have white hats. Now white hats uh, are professional hackers uh, similar, uh, who have a similar skill set to uh, the black hats but they use their skills for security uh, analyst, uh, analysts and um, they basically use it for the uh, defensive side of the spectrum. Uh, we then have grey hats. Uh, grey hats are, these are basically um, hackers who are in the middle of the, f the playing field and are just on the fence. They are both uh, black hat and white hat hackers. And finally we have the fourth one which uh, many of you may not have heard is, are the suicide hackers. So suicide hackers are individuals who just aim to bring down critical infrastructure for a cause and they really don't care about the consequences so all they care about is completing the hack destroying the system or stealing data and they don't care if they get arrested so that's basically the type of hackers now the next thing I want to talk about are the faces of hacking now uh, these are very very important points here um, this is basically the steps that you need to follow here for a successful hack so uh, step one, reconnaissance or footprinting. Now, this is basically getting information about the target. This can be done actively or passively. Actively meaning you can go into the offices and you can see what computers they're running, what operating systems they're running, what server uh, they have, and pa passively can be done through uh, social engineering. Uh, so, yeah, that's basically getting information about the target. Now, step two is scanning. Scanning is getting some more information about the target uh, using uh, tools like port scanners, NS lookup and ping. Just getting some uh, details about uh, how the servers or the connection is. Uh, now step three is gaining access. This is where you actually uh, hack the system to gain access. Alright, so this is where you're performing the hack. So in step four we have maintaining access. This is just maintaining your position in the system while you're stealing or ma manipulating the data. So this is just making sure that you stay in the system while you're performing whatever you wanted to do. And step five uh, is one of the most important uh, parts of the hack, covering your tracks to make sure that you're untraceable and the hack cannot be traced back to you. So this is the first lesson. I just wanted to give you guys an overview of, um, or a basic um, overview of hacking and uh, the types of hackers and the phases of hacking. In the next lesson, uh, we'll be setting up the hacking environment. So yeah, hope you guys uh, liked this video. If it did help you, leave a like, uh, comment below what other videos you want me to make. And uh, thank you so much for watching. Goodbye.